Hi, I have a sample scene here where I have a 40 mm pipe which is a from, coming in from a linked file, a 50 mm pipe, 80 mm pipe, and two sets of pipe. In my so in my source file, I have walls of 90, 140, and these as a type of the tags, and the intersection sets are one with the pipe 40, one with 50, one with 80, and one set with two pipes at the same time. Now, based on these criteria, I have set some rule, and we'll see that before we, uh, you know, execute the rule. Just one second. So here we have set some rules for walls and pipes. So right now we have three pipes in the scene, but we are considering only two of them. So in that case, the pipes that are not considered in the rule will be left alone. There will be no error accordingly. So the first pipe is considering with 40 diameter pipe. Second pipe rule is considering 50 diameter pipe. Okay. Now, as per the first rule, if the pipe is intersecting with, uh, with 40 mm dia, then the minimum thickness that I need to search is 100. If it is intersecting with, uh, that is rule set 2 is intersecting with 50, so the minimum thickness is 150. Now, these values can be changed as per the rule 2. Rule 3 is about the walls that are intersecting with both, that is 40 as well as 50 mm. Then the rule five, 4 is basically for the walls uh, which are of a specific type that is interior block wall and are intersecting with a 50 mm pipe. In that case, they are uh, minimum rule set has to be 150. Similarly, the same filtered wall type that is interior block wall 100 is intersecting with a 50 mm type and the minimum wall thickness that needs to be uh, filtered is 200. So, the result that we are now going to be displaying are going to be like the guys who are meeting the criteria of tagging the basic wall. Just I'll just make this as per pipe rule. Just one second. So is versus basic wall versus pipe rule one okay i'm sorry it's rule one pipe i'm sorry for this Now, the guys who are meeting the criteria will be tagged by a text mark which says plus minimum thickness 40 mm pipe. Okay. Whereas the guys who are not meeting the criteria will be colored in the 3D element in a red color. Whereas the guys who are meeting the element are also going to be colored in the 3D uh, scene with a green color. That is the same case with all of these guys who are going to specify us in a, a particular. Uh, uh, just a minute. I need to change all of this so that our pipe. So uh, we will just see that these are the set of pipes which is intersecting commonly to both the elements rule one pipe and rule two pipe as well. That is in our case, it is 40 and 50 mm dia pipes. Uh, again, the guys who are meeting the criteria will be tagged in a 2D scene and in the 3D scene, they will be colored. Uh, this is again tagging wall types as per rule one, which is, it has to be rule two, I'm, I'm sorry for this. Uh, yeah, so now here, the third type is basically the block walls that we have filtered. All these above walls are excluding the block wall. And these two criteria are only for 40 mm pipe intersection 
specifically with the wall uh, block wall type and here it's 50 mm dia with the wall uh, block wall type again the color elements are green and red uh, as per the scene in a 3d scene and that's it we can as per the, this is these are the criteria set as a sample file see if the same criteria are applied on the project we can change the criteria to the 70 mm dia as per the excel sheet given and the 100 mm dia similarly we can have like 200 mm or 200 centimeters etc 20 centimeters similarly here we can have one block wall or we can have multiple block walls for that we will have to code it accordingly that's it and now we run the schedule So it's done and we'll try to create, I have created a coordination uh, view here. So that's allowing us to see the files in a shaded mode as well. And this is coordination. Let's go with the 3D script view. And Okay, so here I will just try to run the script once again so that I can see the coloring values. I've kept it in a manual mode is why I'm not getting the colors in this view right now. But if I run it once again, that's it. You can see here that it has rendered the color. Okay. And if I change the sizes and I update it, so accordingly, the guys who are not meeting the criteria as per their own given sets will be in red color and the guys who are meeting the criteria are in green color. Okay. Thank you.